After action report. R. Operation. Halt hammer. Op 2403224. Unit. Cherneris 1st Army Corps Task Force. Location. Southern Cherneris, Nadezhdino, Pusta. 1. Situation. Enemy. Separatist forces, including Russian-speaking militia, Wagner Group operators, and Spetsnaz. Strength estimated at one company plus per village. Possessed T-55, T-34 tanks, BRDM scout car, and BMP APC. Friendly. Task force composed of elements from 1st Battalion, 19th Separate Mechanized Cavalry Regiment. Supporting armor included two XT-72 tanks. Weather. Thunderstorms and heavy rains limited mobility. 2. Mission. Conduct a major defensive ground operation to halt separatist advance and prevent capture of Nadezhdino, Pusta, and Mogilevka villages. 3. Execution. Nadezhdino. Task force deployed with two T-72 tanks. Initial enemy attacks from the northeast were repelled by vehicle fire. However, a Spetsnaz attack from the northwest inflicted casualties and disrupted command. Despite communication issues, the task force continued defense and repelled further probes until ordered to withdraw south. Pusta. Task force established defensive positions and engaged enemy forces advancing from multiple directions. A combination of armor, heavy machine guns, and rifle fire prevented enemy incursion. Due to deteriorating overall situation, the operation was cancelled, and the task force ordered to return. 4. Results. Friendly. Objective not achieved. Task force successfully defended Nadezhdino and Pusta, inflicting significant casualties on enemy forces, estimated 1 XT-55, 1 XT-34, 1 XBRDM, 1 XBMP. However, withdrawal was necessary due to command disruption and enemy pressure. Friendly losses were minimal. Command Squad, 3, Second Squad 2. Enemy. Likely conducted probing attacks to test our resolve. 5. Recommendations. Improve communication redundancy within the task force. Refine command succession protocols. Conduct training for operating under limited visibility and extreme weather conditions. Analyze enemy tactics and revise defensive plans to address potential Spetsnaz infiltration. 6. Conclusion. The task force demonstrated strong defensive capabilities despite communication issues and bad weather. However, the mission objective was not achieved due to enemy pressure and loss of command control. The information gathered will be used to refine future defensive strategies against separatist forces.